you guys. I hope you had a great week. Today I have my Friday favorite. So I'm going to share with you five different products that I have been loving this week. So here we go. First up is my John Masters Organics Sea Mist. I have had this hiding away for the past few months because you know, it's winter, I don't I don't need new salt, sea salt spray, and I was missing it. I, for some reason, was like, I need some volume in my hair. I found this down in the bottom of a drawer, pulled it out, and I've been obsessed all week long. So this is a sea salt spray with lavender oil in here. A lot of people are always like, oh, why don't you just make your sea salt spray, which you totally can, and I have tried that, and it did not turn out good, so I was just like, I'm just gonna buy it, buy it, who cares. I first heard about this from Karina from Tone It Up. She uses this and I wanted whatever she uses for her hair. Her hair is amazing. This is going to make your hair give you a lot of volume, make you have that texturized look like you just went to the beach. Um, I just spray it all throughout my hair and scrunch it up and it will dry your hair a little bit. This is not like a smoothing serum, you know, this is going to really give you that grit and I love it. I love the look that it gives you. It gives you so much volume. It's amazing. My favorite. Next are two MAC lipsticks. This is the combo that I've been wearing all week long. I have it on my lips right now. It is Blankety and Pretty Please. So Blankety is amplified. It is a really creamy, rich texture. I love, love this lipstick. It is my go-to color. It is a beautiful nude with a little bit of pink in it and a little bit of brown almost, but it doesn't look, it doesn't come across as brown. And then this is Pretty Please, which is a frosty, pinky, purpley shade. I love using this lipstick on top of any color. It makes your lips look a lot fuller because it gives them a pout. I put it just all over and it's beautiful. It lightens up any lip color and the combination of these two is the perfect nude love. Next I have my Sigma Brow Powder. This is in the shade Auburn and this is the perfect, the absolute perfect color for my eyebrows. I mean, look at that. That is so spot on. I'm wearing it today. I've been wearing it in the past few videos, so I don't know if you guys have noticed a difference in color, but before, I have a lot of brow products. So I wanted to kind of show you what I've been using. So before, I've been using the Brow Bar To Go by Whitening Lining, and then I have the Anastasia Brow Powder in Brunette Dark Brown. Because I went brunette like one week in college, and felt the need to buy an Anastasia brow powder at the time because I thought it was the only way to go so that's why I have this. Anyways, I've been using these two and I mean they work for my hair but they're just a lot darker and especially this Anastasia one is a lot more ashy in tone so um, I was, I've was i been going back to my roots and just trying to use what actually matches. I also have the Anastasia in Strawburn which is they're pretty similar, but the Sigma one is a little bit darker. It has a little bit more red, or not red, a little bit more brown tones in it, which matches my hair a lot better. Next, I have the NYX Dark Circle Concealer. This is in the shade uh, One Fair, and it is a salmon-colored concealer. So all of these Dark Circle Concealer Pots by NYX have a little bit of an orangey salmon undertone to them, which is perfect for canceling out dark circles. I love these. They are so creamy and I use these alone. I don't even use a concealer on top because I don't have the like really dark circles under my eyes. So this works perfectly just by itself. I put this underneath my eyes with my finger and then I blend it in with a brush and it is awesome. It doesn't settle into any fine lines. It's not super dry. The only thing is NYX products don't have the best ingredients but I'll get over it. And last I have a random food item. I have been so in love with these all week long. They are by the brand Element. So these are from France, I believe, right? Yeah. And they are delicious. So they're right, they have rice cakes and corn cakes and I got these off of Vitacost. And they're non-GMO, gluten-free, all natural, no preservatives, and they have all different flavors. So I have the sweet orange rice cakes dark chocolate rice cake and milk chocolate rice cake. These are perfect at night if I'm watching TV and I'm like, I wanna eat something, I just grab one of these because they don't have that many calories so I can just snack on this and it satisfies my sweet tooth. Delicious. So those are all of my favorites for the week. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you soon. Bye.